Well, you know, in the American Chamber of Commerce, uh, what they, when they cite studies that say that cap and trade, as currently formulated, is going to cripple the economy, those are those are somewhat biased studies. I mean, you can find others like the the the, the uh, Congressional Budget Office, nonpartisan group that doesn't have a dog in the fight, and they say that on the whole, this this will cost American families very little. I mean, they will barely notice it. Um, so I, I tell them to look at that, and even within the chamber. Just over the past week, week and a half, you've seen a number of large companies and utilities leaving the Chamber of Commerce because they see what they're doing with cap and trade as being unfair, being, being bad for the country. They see that some form of carbon pricing has to come if we want to deal with climate change. They believe climate change is real. We have to stop ignoring that fact. And so they're, you know, these companies have left the Chamber say, we'd rather have the certainty of this kind of regulation than this continued back and forth war that's really not benefiting anyone.